Welcome to the Vector Garden. In this quick tip, we're going to center a brush. I have these two shapes and they should be a brush. So let's take the brushes panel and just take them and drag them in here. And then we create an art brush just like this. And then you see that blue line here with the arrow that symbolizes the path. This brush will be applied not a lot like I want to have it. I want to have the path run exactly at the border of these two shapes. So let's take a look at it. I've got a path here and let's apply the brush and you see that border is not aligned with the path. So in order to get what I want, I need to have that shape equal on both sides. If the height of this equals the height of that, then we get that path in the center. But obviously that is not the case and I cannot change the shapes. So what I need to do is somewhat cheat illustrator. And that is done by drawing an invisible rectangle. So let's take the rectangle tool and what we can do is start in the center. So I'm going to turn on the smart guides and the smart guides highlight that center. And then I can start here, press the alt key and then drag that out so that it's higher than the widest point of that brush shape. So the bottom needs to be beyond that green shape. So let's drag it to here and drag it to there so that the shape is inside. And now it needs to be made invisible. So let's turn off that black stroke and also it needs to be in the background. So let's go to object, arrange, send to back. And then we can select all of them, including that rectangle and then drag them into the brushes panel, make an art brush. And you can already see that blue line, that arrow runs exactly on the border of these two shapes. So let's go to OK like this. And then let's make a copy of this and apply the new brush. And you see this time it matches exactly. So that's how you do it.